So happy you're here, and uh, and so is our audience. I mean, look, listen to that. Thank I'm, you. The four people and the roots, obviously. Uh, it's gonna be interesting hearing you perform with no crowds. <laughs> it's almost like being like at your rehearsals or something. It's kind of like a yeah, slightly elevated like a, rehearsal. Like a sound check. This yeah. is your first album in eleven years. In eleven years. Congrats on this. Thank so, you. I love the name Silver Landings. Mm -hmm. uh, how'd you come up with that title? Uh, it was the last song that we wrote for the record, and to me it was sort of like the idea of a silver lining yeah. actualized, something that felt really grounded and earthbound, and everything that it sort of took to write and record and make this record after being gone for so long. Yeah. When you're getting back into it, do you ever go back to your old catalog? Just oh, to yeah. listen to what you used to do, like, okay, that's my sound. Or Let's that's... not do that? No. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, come I, on. No, certainly. I, I have, um, I've kind of come full circle with a lot of, like, my older Good. stuff. We we're, are supposed to go on tour. Um, I haven't toured in 13 years, so it's very precarious timing. <laughs> but I have a picture of Everything you. that's happening in the world. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. This is when you were 15 on tour, I believe That right? was my very first tour. Um, oh, I, I flew on. from doing the Candy music video in Los Angeles to Virginia Beach, Virginia to open for NSYNC on their summer amphitheater tour. That's a gig. It was a gig. I mean, and and this <laughs> this van was like a marketing van. You, oh, I was going to say, this your van. No, okay, no. you didn't. And they would pass out uh, Casingles, remember Casingles, yes, guys? Of course. They would pass out my exactly. Quest, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, they would. <laughs> would Casingles. Well, I just want to explain at home to the children. Yeah. yeah kiss, kiss, there were cassettes. But, a cassette oh, that single. That doesn't make any sense either. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. You have to. Antiquated technology yeah. that Google you don't it. need to Google worry it. about. Google it. Yeah. Yeah. But they would pass out these kiss singles I had of my singles. first single. Yeah. And it, it so it followed us everywhere that whole tour and uh, yeah, pretty wow. crazy. Is, but I've kind of like come full circle. Like I was saying about the idea of um, I have a song on my record called 15, and it's talking all about this exact time. I mean, I've been in the industry for 20 years now. I signed a record deal when I was 15, and sort of started in the industry. And I think for a long time I apologize for that time of my life and that like chapter because I had no creative control and I've kind of come full circle to have a lot of affection for that girl because she lives in me and I carry her around she's the reason we're talking and yeah. uh, so it's been an interesting thing to sort of digest and come to terms with over the course of making this record too. Uh, I thought I read somewhere that you at one point thought about quitting acting before This Is Us. You did. You know, it's this business is tricky. It's you tough. know, it's like there is a real ebb and flow to everything in life. But um, I, I had done four failed TV pilots, and I remember going in for like an audition with some actor, like chemistry read for a show that I was like, oh, um, I don't really feel connected to this, but okay, yeah. And I remember going in and feeling pretty good about the audition, and then coming out and finding like. I didn't get it. And I was like, what? I didn't get the thing I didn't even really want. I was like, this is the universe telling me this is done so You're for actually me. mad that you didn't get the part yes, you didn't want. Yes, I was want. like, what? Like, I didn't even want it. What's wrong with these people? I'm perfect <laughs> for this awful show. <laughs> so I felt like, I was like, you know what? Maybe it's time to go back to Florida where I'm from. Maybe it's time to go back to school. I really was reconsidering everything and I, I you know, gave myself like a, a couple days to feel really down about everything and then I think the idea of just like the constant nature of rejection being a part of the actor's life. Yeah. I had some patience and, and six months later, This Is Us came into my, my Man, world. Man, I would say this, everything. this season has been, I think it's your season because oh, you have such thanks. a great storyline, but thanks. you're putting some good acting chops yeah. in it. And, and <laughs> oh, thank it, you. What your character's going through, it's yeah. it's tricky subject and all that stuff, but all it the is. time traveling in different scenes and you pull it off seamlessly. Thank uh, you. you were fantastic in it. Thanks, uh, I was going to ask because we've had Milo on the show, yeah, and I know uh, 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 Justin. Justin directed an episode as well. Yeah, when they, are you going to direct? An <laughs> they both directed an episode this season, and I would love to. You have to. It, I would love to, and I feel like every single cast member wants to sort of try their hand <laughs> at directing before the show yeah. is done, and they've kind of like given us the nod, like it'll happen. You have two more episodes left There's for only the season. For yes. the season, yes. And the next one, I saw the promos because. I NBC all the time. Yeah, yeah. All day and all night. <laughs> and it's Same. like, uh, uh, what do you see? Blah, 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 blah. This is up. <laughs> and it's like, what if Jack didn't die? Yeah. Like, what if Jack lived? Yes. But I didn't, I didn't see you in the promo. Really. I, I'm in it. Don't worry. 
I think there's a lot obviously focused on dad because what if dad didn't die? How would that affect our life? But mom, mom is still there. Okay. Oh yeah, no, no. Okay. There was a lot of tears shed for the next episode. I think I cried pretty much the entire episode. Not as Mandy as as Rebecca. <laughs> you need to go on tour. You need that or a vacation. I need to like <laughs> rebuild my adrenals or something. <laughs> my tear ducts. Guys, break. Re rebuild your adrenals right now. I want to show a clip. <laughs> Here's Mandy Moore in This Is Us. Take a look. Wow. Watch out, Helen Mirren. Oh, stop it. You know she's my spirit animal. She's everybody's spirit animal. <laughs> hmm. Hey, Kev. Mm hmm I have a silly question for you. Yeah. I'm embarrassed to ask. What? No, come on. Oh. I'm mad. Can I walk the red carpet with you tonight? I know I tell you I never want to do that sort of stuff, but... I just feel like it would be a shame to waste this dress. Well, yes, yes, of course. Yeah. Yes, of course. That'd be great. Thank you. I'm, I'm so excited. I never get to do this sort of thing. Thank you. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Perfectly done. Perfectly done. Okay. Mandy Moore, This Is Us airs Tuesdays at 9 p.m. on NBC.